Hey, what's up? We're doing the uh, canteen quest, the submarine struggle. We're gonna try to get rid of the green plesioth and the loyal, royal, <laughs> not the loyal, but the royal Ludra. Ration. Am I gonna take first aid med or not? Take, yep, take it. Hmm. Run around, wait for them. Okay. Lock and load. Get some more. Get one more. Yeah. One more. And... Now let's go. Oh my goodness. Yep. They'll be both here. Boop. 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 There's no escape for them. There's no escape for you. So you gotta be careful. If you get hit... It's gonna be a solid shot, so you know, better to uh, use some potions, some health potions, just in case you get trapped by these two monsters. You know, it doesn't hurt. You'll actually give your team a peace of mind, you know, by not dying. There's three deaths, and you're out. Well, you're all out. You all lose. So let's try to break something from this green plasma, just in case I need some materials from him in the future. It doesn't hurt to get uh, good wound carbs. I mean, good wound rewards from him. Oh yeah, recently I uh, have fully upgraded my Alatrion longsword, the uh, that Reaper-looking thing. Paralyzed already? Wait, was he paralyzed or, or what? No, no, he wasn't paralyzed. I'm gonna put down a a trap. Yeah, good deal. Great job, guys. Oh goodness. Oh, oh. tail whip. Get away. Eat. Mmm. Days. Oh! <laughs> I, I don't know how I dodged that, but good deal. Good deal. Eat it. Boop. Boop. Mmm. Oh my goodness, Ludroth. Come on. We're busy over here. I'll try and kill this uh, Plesioth first before that Royal Ludra deep fried with my fist solution. Guess it is the solution for this problem. This underwater problem. Speaking of which, underwater, <laughs> more underwater for Monster Hunter 4. Well, I, well, I uh, think a lot of people will, you know, will be kind of glad because of that, but. I had to say I'm gonna miss, you know, underwater fights, even though they're uh, annoying as hell. Because I don't know. I'm not sure if there's a pro dodge, you know, the dive dodge kind of thing mechanic for underwater. I don't think so. There's no invulnerability period, I think, for the uh, for that kind of. Oh my goodness, you draw. Stop that. For that kind of dodge for underwater, underwater fights. Oh, okay, we're done with Green Plesioth. Goodbye. Thanks for coming. And I'm gonna carve it. And you will actually get materials from it. You're not gonna, you're not gonna get mega potions, so that's a good thing. Shard. Mm. Plesioth Fang. What can I get next? Uber Plesio. Okay. Ain't that something? No. Nope. Mm. Although the uh, Royal Ludroth is easier to fight underwater, his twirling here and there. Okay. 
will get annoying, especially you know if you're all over him. And oh my, if, especially if you're all over him, and he will turn here, and he will turn there. When he does that, yep, he can cause damage. But good thing is, it's not as much as the green plasma that hits pretty hard. Somebody join the port, but unfortunately for you, we are halfway done with this quest. So we're gonna finish this quest, sir. Hello. Just in case you're muted. Hmm. Hmm. Bang. Wyvern's fire. Yeah, I'm again I'm a gun last user, so I appreciate the Wyvern's fire. Or any good combo from a gunlance. So yeah, if I'm using a gun lance and you see me missing with the uh, you know dashing attack with an upward upward poking slashing motion that means I'm just trying to get close to a monster safely while my weapon is unsheathed so there you go come on oh boy oh boy drink hmm <laughs> and Timing, get a timing right. Dive. Oh, I got what? Somebody else. Okay, okay, I got shot. <gasps> no. Sit still, damn it. It's time to dance. Just dance. Oh, come on, sit still, man. Yep. Speed sharpening, dual swords, efficient skill. Ah, uh, God! Damn it! I'm almost out of air, but I got oxygen supply. I always do. Never take it for granted. Never take it for granted. You need air. Even though in the water arena there's a spot for oxygenation, and we're done. We are done. How about that? So yeah, I just mostly pot shot with the... You know... <laughs> with any weapon, especially if I'm trying to adjust to a monster because I fight monsters, you know, different monsters in a... Especially if I haven't fought a monster for a while, I'm gonna pot shot it and then I, if I get, you know, once, once I get the timing right... Uh, especially, you know, for example, I'm using a dual sword, then I would do demon dance here and there if the time is right it's better to be safe than being so reckless and you know double carding or triple carding and you know as a worst case scenario so there you have it if you like this video leave a like put your comments down below favorite and subscribe if you like my stuff you guys have a wonderful day thanks for watching see you next time